Pete Evans. <laughs> Paleo Pete. <laughs> no, no. Controversial <laughs> chef. Yes. Who Dangerous knew? in some ways. Is he a mate of yours? No. Well, you posted a photograph. With I know. I, look, Why? Well, I was doing he, – he asked to interview me on cannabis – and on, and you know, I think my views are pretty clear on cannabis on, on this program. Um, so he asked to do an interview with me on a program that he was doing on cannabis, which I agreed to. We took a photo. I must say I didn't know much about him. I, I don't watch a lot of reality TV, I'm afraid. Um, and we took a photo and boy, did it cause a stir that somehow by having a photo next to him, I all of a sudden no, became an No, but you also tweeted about him. What did you tweet? I said, oh, it was great meeting Peter Evans and doing a program with him on cannabis. You know, this bloke's an anti-vaxxer, for heaven's sake. Yeah. I, he advises I'm, people to look at the sun. I know. I am not an anti-vaxxer. I should wear more sunscreen, but I'm pro-sunscreen and I've never, ever eaten bone broth, I don't think, in my life. Now, look, I suspect that you have probably been in a photo with people whose views you don't agree on. Yeah, but I don't think I've tweeted in support of them. No, I don't think it was a tweet in support. It was just... Great to meet him. Yeah, well, it was nice to meet him. We were doing a cannabis, you know, we were doing a cannabis documentary. I was at a medical cannabis symposium. So is he, a, is he a dangerous and... wacko or not? I, I must say, I, don't, I honestly have not looked much into to him. But, you know, it's ba- it is terrible when people of, you know, great popularity, as he seems to be, um, are promoting things like questioning vaccination. I am completely pro-vaccination, and I think people who are anti-vaccination, you know, should be, should be brought to justice. And I think there are real concerns about... Um, what about staring at the sun? Is that a good idea? No, I don't think it's a good what idea. What about not wearing sunscreen? Is that a good idea? No, none what of those What about his ideas. paleo diets for kids? None of those ideas are good ideas. But you see Absolutely. this bloke, he's, he's got a record of this. I mean, you're right, and you, you go to a function, you can be photographed, but I've been, been photographed yeah. with a mafia leader and I wouldn't know because I wouldn't recognise no. him. But you wouldn't know known who paleo Pete was. Look, so I you knew... know that he's, he's controversial no, at the very least. Yeah, sort of. I mean, on the, on the edges I knew that. I mean, I knew that he was some celebrity chef, but I knew what I knew was we were doing a documentary on cannabis. I was at a scientific symposium, and he was set up doing interviews there, and I did an interview with him. You know, I, I think that was all I did. I'm, I'm what pro- was the interview for? It was a cannabis documentary, and I, he asked me my position on prohibition and on how I thought the laws should change in regards to that and in regards to greater access to have, medicinal cannabis. Have you cannabis. removed the photograph? Yeah, we have. Why? Because it seemed to upset so many you people. You got a lot of a lot of your supporters yeah, it, were angry. It it upset an awful lot of people, and I so I take I take that point. You know, it upset people. I listened to that and I took it down. From Sabine was a classic one. Quote: Out of all the seemingly intelligent people at the symposium, you chose to pose with a dangerous dickhead. Yeah, and Sabine, as as I think I commented, sent a few photos. I'd also did actually pose with an awful lot of people at the symposium.